It's homecoming day in Portsmouth. U.S. Coast Guard Cutter Tampa sailed into port today. The crew spent nearly three months serving in the Florida Straits and Caribbean Sea. New at six, photojournalist Jason Walsh gives us a look at the heartwarming reunions. He has been gone for 88 days. Not that we're counting. <laughs> we're getting through it, um, but it is tough. He misses a lot of milestones. Like I said, his third birthday. Really miss him. Looking forward for him to come home because it's when they're going out. I mean, they're doing great things, but it's it can be hard and it'll be wonderful to see him come in. And we left Portsmouth, Virginia in January and for the last 88 days, we've been working with our interagency partners in the Straits of Florida down to the Windwards Passage and in the Caribbean Sea for a multi-mission operations, migrant interdiction operations, and counter-drug operations. The Coast Guard's involved in a lot of border security and also protection of those on the sea. I've been going to sea for about 10 years, and it doesn't get easier leaving, but it's always rewarding coming home. All right, I'm hey! And just the pride that we have for the mission that we do, knowing that our families support us, they love us, and they're, you know, a tether to us as we're gone. Their support always enables our mission success. Oh, it's very nice to be back. Longer patrol than we expected uh, originally that we were planned for, but, you know, missed him, ready to come back home. Yeah, I was very excited. I even took a little video, sang a song, everything. <laughs> I, was, I was happy. It's been a long time. 